Hey guys, so I wanted to start off with a recap of my 2018. Um, I celebrated my birthday with my friends and it was one of the best days ever in January. February, I got to practice with a squad of friends to do this quinceanera. March, I got my permit, went to the movies, and to a jumping place, and ate Chick-fil-A for the first time. I went to the aquarium with my friends and also got prom tickets. I went to the mansions and was able to ride a limousine to my cousin's sweet 15, the quinceanera. I went to prom and it was fun. I got to dress up and feel pretty and watch everyone else dance. June, I went on my first roller coaster ever with my friends and had the best of times. I then saw my little sweet, sweet brother graduate and he's in middle school living his life. David, my boyfriend, told me he liked me to stay and I couldn't have been happier. I went to the movies more. I went to South Carolina where I got to go to the beach, see some cute cats and dogs. Meow. When I got back, I went on dates with David and also got to go to Six Flags with Madison and with the rest of the squad. I later on then watched Coco for the first time and I cried my eyes out. <laughs> August, I went to a Salvadorian festival, which was so cool seeing my culture all in one place, watching the Mexicans. Ariana Grande snapped on her album, and I obviously didn't know how to handle it, so here are some dance moves for ya. I then started getting more into makeup and also invited my friends over to go on the trampoline. Dark Child started and that crazy stupid trend that everyone was doing, I tried. I went to the beach for the last day of summer with Madeline and then high school started. Seniors. September. Soccer officially started and more soccer things in October. I made my first official goal on October 15th and I had senior night in my last game. October I also celebrated my brother's birthday party, which was really fun. Love you, Oh my god! <laughs> November we went out to IHOP and I was so anxious for December to, and I made gingerbread houses with my bowl plant. We had Friendsgiving and it was a great day to get stuffed in food with one another. Cute little Polaroid. I went on to the Hanover Theater with my best friend and finally got into the office. Best decision I've ever made. <laughs> now, I think you guys know what December was all about. Sorry for my cringy voiceover, it's just, I don't have a good microphone, so I apologize. But, that was it for this video. I hope you guys got the gist of what 2018 was all about. I really loved 2018, it really did treat me best of the best. 2017 was great too. I'll leave the link in the description of the video that I did of that year, because I also did a video like this, reminiscing of all the times that I had that were memorable in that year. So I hope you guys like this video. Um, I'm so freaking grateful for everything that's happened this year 
and I hope that 2019 is just filled with more love and happiness and great amazing things coming my way and your way. I hope you have a great 2019. Every year is different. Every year is not the same. Obviously, I just said every year is different. Oh my god, Danya. I'm trying to be inspirational and cute, but it's not working out. I'm just being stupid. It's literally 2, 2 a.m. January 1st. I'm tired, but I stayed up editing this. It's already one minute long. I... Okay, well, anyways, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I really hope that so much more growth happens on this channel. I really expect myself to do better and create more things for my viewers because I love YouTube so much. I love to create things and then later on look at them and be like, wow, I did all of that. And then to put all of that stuff on my channel is super cool because they're just memories that I want to remember forever and I hope you can come along with me and reminisce as well. But yeah, I hope you guys had a very great new year and keep having it for the time being. Bye! Please watch all my vlogmas, all the videos that your little heart desires on my channel if you want. And if you don't want to, then that's okay too. Hashtag love and happiness. Goodbye. Okay, <laughs>